Hello YouTube, my name is Shruti and you're watching Tickle Me Pink. Wow, <laughs> it's been a long time since I said that. I know, I know it's been about like two months since I posted a video and I am so, 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 so sorry for like having completely disappeared without leaving a trace. That was really bad of me. But basically, if I have to be honest, what happened was that I completely underestimated how difficult it was going to be to move to a new country. And I guess like somewhere, life just got in the way of me doing this. But I've had like two months to think about what I want to do with YouTube and this channel. And I've had a really, really rejuvenating holiday last month, during which also I thought about what I wanted to do with this channel. And the conclusion that I came to is that I can keep thinking and overthinking about what kind of content I want on this channel or how I want to revive this channel. But the bottom line is that making videos, making videos that I love on YouTube is what makes me happy. So what I'm going to do and one of my resolutions for 2018 is that no matter how busy my life gets, no matter how difficult it seems, I am going to make time to do this, to make videos on YouTube because that is what makes me happy, that is what motivates me and that is what puts a smile on my face. I've given myself a goal of uploading at least one video a week. If I get the time, there might be two videos up here but a minimum of one video is what you guys are going to get so yeah. Anyway. Coming back to the rejuvenating holiday that I spoke about, if you follow me on Instagram, which if you don't, you should totally do, shameless plug, <laughs> but if you follow me on Instagram, you will know that I visited Thailand and Cambodia last month with my husband and one of our really close friends. Now, while we were in Thailand, we were in Bangkok for two days and the basic tourists that we are, while we were in Bangkok, of course, we shopped. Now Bangkok is a really cool shopping destination like there are a number of malls that you can shop in Bangkok and they have a lot of cool street shopping where you get like the fake brands or like first copies. Then there was the mall that we visited which was Platinum Mall where basically you get like unbranded things. So these are like small boutiques and like startup manufacturers that make clothes and they have some really cool designs and like there are some quirky shops and really cool accessories. So that's the place where we visited and I picked up a few things. So I thought I'll share them with you guys. So the first thing that I picked up was the first thing that I saw when I stepped into the mall. And that was this hat. I have always been obsessed with hats. Like since I was a kid, I have absolutely adored hats and this one was so so pretty I'll show you in a minute but it has a bow on the back and it just looks so adorable I absolutely love it and the coolest thing about this is that it is foldable so like you can just sort of like crush it and fold it and it fits easily in your bag so it's really cool when you have to travel the next thing that I bought is this off shoulder top now there were a bunch of off-shoulder tops and they had so many patterns but I absolutely fell in love with this one. I really like the Hawaiian like pine tree pattern which is on this. It gives it a really casual vibe but because of the colour, because it's like navy blue and it has like a dark green, I think you can also wear it for like a semi-formal occasion especially if you dress it up with like a choker and some really cool accessories I think it can go really well for even an evening party the next thing that I bought is this beautiful kimono now the thing that I really really love about this is that it looks like an actual silk kimono from Japan like the cranes which are on this give it a really really oriental feel and I think it can add a lot of elegance to a simple outfit like a tank top in shorts and it's just so pretty the next item that I bought is my absolute favorite and that is this dress and the best thing about it is that it has pineapples on it I just feel this dress has such a summery vibe like it has a similar pine tree pattern to like the off shoulder top that I showed you but the pineapples I think just add an element of fun to this dress and the minute I saw it in the shop I was just like 
take all my money i need this dress <laughs> it is so so elegant like i don't have that many long dresses and i think it's just like perfect for a sunday brunch or just about any occasion the next few things that i got are just some casual t-shirts but i really love them because of the pattern the first one is this really cute aloha t-shirt i really really like this one as well it has a cool like surfer vibe to it plus the back of the t-shirt is sort of like cut out so i think this gives it a really cool cut so just like pairing it up with like blue jeans or like ripped jeans or even shorts i think is just a really casual fun outfit moving along the next t-shirt is this one <laughs> isn't it the cutest i mean look at this bunny look at it how can you not fall in love with this pattern like this is just a really plain tank top and i think it's really good to just like wear on the beach or just like just about anywhere but i just thought that the bunny is so so adorable and i had to have it and the last t-shirt that i bought is this one now this one actually my husband forced me to buy if you guys don't know i've done my masters in perfumes and cosmetics and He just thought it would be really fitting for me to have this T-shirt because it has like a bottle of Chanel Number no. Five, the world's most famous perfume, on it, and it's kind of cool and it has like a really pretty design. So I gave in and I let him buy it for me. <laughs> and the last few things that I bought are actually in this pouch. This pouch being one of the things that I bought. I absolutely adore owls so like whenever I see anything which has owls on it or like owl accessories I'm instantly drawn towards them and I have to have them so I bought this pouch and this bracelet um I'll show you a close up soon but it's basically this turquoise and gold elephant bracelet now Thailand is like super famous for elephants so a quick tip this is going to get serious but If you do visit Thailand, I really really strongly recommend that you do not go to visit the elephants. Um there are a bunch of places in Thailand which offer like elephant safaris and elephant rides and stuff. Uh the thing is that the people who conduct these safaris and the people who conduct uh the elephant rides, they ill treat the elephants a lot and there have been documentaries and a lot of videos even on YouTube that you can search where they show that the elephants are actually really depressed and they cry and it's just really really sad for the elephants um so if you do ever visit please please don't go to visit the elephants or if you do have to i think there are a few companies which treat the elephants well and they let them sort of live in the wild and you see them from a distance and if you can like google up these agencies which handle this entire situation really well and not the ones who exploit the elephants and completely ill treat them but coming back to the haul this bracelet is super pretty i really like the combination of turquoise and gold i am a huge sucker for anything turquoise but i absolutely love this and the last thing that i bought is this pocket watch necklace now this pocket watch was so so beautiful and it had such a cool like victorian steampunk kind of vibe to it like the pattern of the birds and flowers on one side and like the really cool pattern of the flowers on the other side is just so unique and even like the watch inside like the dial is just so so pretty and like old fashioned and i just found this really really pretty and cool and i thought it would be good to add to my collection So yeah that was my Bangkok haul. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did then give this video a big fat thumbs up. Comment below letting me know what was your favorite piece from the haul and also let me know what kind of videos you want to see. And one more thing when I was in India in November I shot a video which was kind of like a wedding lookbook like what you could wear for your best friend or your like cousin's wedding but I never edited and uploaded it but it's there the footage is there in my camera so if you guys would like to see that video then also let me know down in the comments and I will edit it and put it up for you guys next week but that's about it from now do subscribe to my channel for weekly fashion and lifestyle videos and yeah I'll see you guys next time bye